Well, I never thought that shopping for a product to satisfy your uh, tush could be such a demanding experience. <laughs> All right, welcome back to Total OS Today, technology for beginners and beyond. Well, you know the feeling. Uh, you have a chair that maybe is not that old, your computer chair, and then you slowly start to slip away. The chair starts to lower itself, starts to sink, and it won't stay up. Now, I have did some searching, uh, and I've come to the conclusion that if you really want a good chair, you're probably going to have to spend close to $500. I didn't have the $500 to spend. So the question is, could I fix a two-year-old chair? Well, let me show you what I did. I searched YouTube. And first of all, this is the bottom of my chair. This is the hydraulic piston. Of course, that's the handle that adjusted and stuff like that. But that is the uh, piston, the rod that holds the chair up to a certain length. These are the other parts, the, the other metal cover and the little clip there and the plastic uh, pieces there all slide into place and all that good stuff. So that's part one. And by the way, I shot this just with a little handheld uh, camera, flip cam. In part two of this, that's the little PVC pipe, one and a quarter inch uh, plumbing pipe, if you want to call it that I measured, cut it to size. Actually, the very friendly gentleman at Lowe's cut it for me. Thank you. And um, that slides over the piston. And at the end, you saw the little metal piece that finishes the job. So what that means is the chair will no longer sink. Of course, it will no longer be adjustable. But since I'm tall, I don't want it to sink. I want to sit high to be comfortable. Now, once you have this little PVC uh, pipe here, and the other metal part, you put the other pieces together, such as the bottom part of, it, part of it, where you put the wheels on and all that. I didn't really feel a need to show you all that. I think you get the picture and how that works. But I'm actually sitting on it now, and it was kind of funny. After I fixed it, I was like, is this really going to hold? So I'm like, you know, jumping up and down on the chair, trying to break it like a little kid with a tantrum, you know? And um, it's not going to sink. Now, probably something else will break, more than likely. But the total cost to fix the chair, of course, I did all the labor. The parts itself with tax was $1.73. How about that? Yes, you can fix your chair if it's not too beat up for very little money. All right, well, that's it for this one. I want to thank all of you who stuck around, who joined us and stuck around for the Total OS Today for a live event. That was a lot of fun to do. I'll probably do one more or do these live events uh, each month, once a month. I try to do these once a month, and I just realized I need to spray some oil on my chair. It still squeaks. Ugh. Why is shopping for a chair such a big freaking deal? All right, well, that's it for this one. Thank you so much for watching and listening. And as always, I will catch all of you sometime in your future.